Greetings everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to use the recovery bin. It is essentially a recycle bin like you would find on any other computer. Whenever you delete a picture or a video, it will actually go here first and it gives you a chance to restore or permanently delete it. Um, so I have here the Nexus 5X, which is running Android 7.0, the latest Android uh, currently. Um, this, ha this also works with Android 6, 5, and 4. I tested on those two. Uh, so let me show you how it works. So when you start the app, um, uh, you, you have to give it, per give it permissions. Uh, and after that, uh, you're immediately presented with a bin, just like if on the computer when you open the recycle bin. Currently, it's empty because you just installed the app. Um, but up here, you can get some instructions on how to use this or, and watch this video. Uh, or you could stop or start the service, uh, which uh, which is the recycle bin ser 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 service. So, so far, the service has been started. Let's go test it. Um, you know, we could, we, could, we could take a picture. Let's take a picture of my desk here. And then maybe take another video of... Uh, of my desk so we got a short video of three seconds stop all right so you know we can go ahead open the gallery um delete the video from the gallery it'll say it's deleted uh let's go check on the bin so inside the bin you'll see voila there was the video that you just deleted let's um so this works not only with your gallery and photo it actually works with any file browser so i have here two uh popular file browsers um oh, Skip that. Okay, all right, so we're in Astro. So usually photos are stored in the DCIM folder. So I could go into Astro. Um, let's, uh, oh, I, I guess I have another video there too. So let's delete both of these actually. So I delete both pictures, go back to my bin. Voila, all three are here. Um, all right, so once you have things here, uh, it will give you the list of things that you've deleted. And the best part about this is it's not using up any extra memory or 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 anything. Um, the algorithm I've I've, I've developed uh, basically keeps a record of these. Um, they're kind of like a shadow. And once you open up the menu, it tells you when you deleted it, which was just now. Uh, and uh, you can see it. So if you press I, you'll you know you'll, so you got oh, it's just me talking. <laughs> um, you can delete it permanently. You know, let's delete this video, or you could let's restore the other video. So and the picture. So we'll restore both these guys. So say file restore. Oh, didn't press it. Oh, sorry, uh, file restore. I don't know why I didn't press that. But anyways, so now if you go back to the uh, gallery app, and now your picture is back. So there's your video. There's your photo. Um, let's delete this. Delete this. Delete this again. Just to show you, there now, now, now they're all back. Uh, let's see. Delete, delete. So now there should be nothing here. Yep, the gallery is empty. Uh, yeah, that's it. So you don't actually need to do anything. You just install the app and just leave it there. Uh, it, the app even works when you restart your phone. Uh, so it's very nice for people who uh, accidentally deleted something or they want to bring some something back. That's it. If you have any questions, feel free to email me. Thanks.